The Netherlands has set clear climate goals, a 50% reduction of CO2 emissions in 2030 and a low-carbon energy system in 2050. For the industry in the port of Rotterdam, this means a major transition. A large share of the port's current emissions come from the use of coal, oil or natural gas to produce electricity and for industrial processes that require vast amounts of heat. For some industrial processes, the industry can switch to green electricity. However, for high temperature heat applications, this is not feasible. This can be achieved by switching from natural gas to low-carbon hydrogen. This can be produced using natural gas or renewable electricity. When hydrogen is produced from natural gas, CO2 is released. By capturing and storing the CO2 from the process, the hydrogen becomes low-carbon. This is called blue hydrogen. Hydrogen can also be produced using green electricity. Here, no CO2 is emitted. This is called green hydrogen. To generate the required amounts of green hydrogen, more green electricity is needed than will become available in the coming decades. To significantly reduce emissions in the short term to meet the Dutch climate goals, blue hydrogen is a pragmatic and feasible solution. In the H-Vision project, 16 parties are working together to investigate the feasibility of the production and application of blue hydrogen to achieve a step change in emissions in the Rotterdam port area. Almost all the CO2 that is produced during the blue hydrogen production will be captured and stored in empty gas fields in the North Sea, or it will be reused. The required infrastructure and the installations that will be installed can also be used for the application of green hydrogen in the future. In this way, investing in blue hydrogen paves the way for a green hydrogen future. With blue hydrogen, the industry in the port of Rotterdam can contribute to a significant reduction of CO2 emissions in the short term and build a sustainable future for everyone. <laughs>